Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel All About Electronics. So in this question, we have been given that any Boolean function can be expressed in the canonical SOP and the POS form. So here, for the given function y, we have been asked to find which one of the following are the correct SOP and the POS form. So here, the function y which is given to us is equal to a plus b bar c. So here, to find the respective canonical SOP in the POS form for this given function, first of all, let us represent this function in the K map. So here, since the function contains only three variables, so to represent this function in the K map, we will require the three variable K map. So in the K map, this A can be represented by these four main terms. Because as you can see over here, in the group of these four main terms, this variable B and C are changing. While if you see the variable a, then it remains constant. Therefore, this group of the four main terms represents the variable a. Likewise, this b bar c can be represented by these two main terms. Because as you can see, in this group of two main terms, the variable a is changing, while the variable b and c remains constant. And if you see the value of the variable b and c, then this b is equal to 0, but the c is equal to 1. Therefore, this group represents the b bar c. So now, by looking at this k map, we can say that this function y contains the 5 main terms. So in the canonical SOP form, it can be represented as the summation of all 5 main terms. That is the summation of these main terms 1, 4, 5, 6 and the 7. And similarly, if we see the canonical POS form, then it contains the max terms that is 0, 2 and the 3. So in the canonical product of some form, it will contain the 3 max terms. And in this way, this given function can be represented in the canonical SOP and the POS form. So from this we can say that for the given question, this B is the correct answer.